All right, so I finally got to watch The Little Prince, a film that I've been somewhat pretty interested in seeing, and for some odd reason it was never released in theaters here in the U.S. I don't know, Paramount dropped the ball on that one. Regardless, Netflix, all I can say is you're my saving grace. So, regardless, here's what I thought about the film. So, to start it off, I was going to be spoiler free, I don't want to ruin anything, so let's start off with the story. Now, weirdly enough, the film has two plots. The plot of the little prince, and an equally as important plot of a young girl named Violet. Both coexist perfectly, and perfectly represent the importance of imagination, friendship, and the dangers of growing up. On top of that, the talent and writing is perfect. It really made me fall in love with the characters in the film. All the voice actors really captured their characters perfectly, and it really made me feel what they were saying. The pacing of the film is brisk, yet soothing. Like, it's constantly going through the story, it's not, you know, it's not stopping at all. It's going through all the motions, yet you feel at peace, you feel calm when you're watching all this. Now let's talk about the overall art design. And, uh, yeah, I really enjoyed the dual animation styles, you know, that are presented in this film. Um, the, ver no, the 3D animation is very vibrant and very, you know, tight. It's like, it, it has a huge influence in, um, shapes. Things are very perpendicular. Things are very like straight lines. It's very you know concrete and very. It, it, it pretty much personifies the character's plight very well. And, and on top of that, um, the other art style that kind of focuses on the the secondary story or the other story of the actual little prince. And this is a very very faithful adaptation of the original um, illustrations of the book, but in stop motion. It's fantastic it looks beautiful it looks great it looks like it's hand-drawn I, I I just really really enjoyed it it looked beautiful seriously overall this is a very soft-spoken film so for young children this is a great thing you know not to get them too excited because it's just a very quaint film I really enjoyed it because of its you know now it may be soft-spoken but it does really hit its you know themes very hard in the sense that as I said before, it focuses on imagination and the dangers of growing up. So, if you want to feel like a kid again, this may be your forte. If you are at all on the fence about watching this film, this is a perfect film for all ages, and if you have any resemblance of a heart, you're going to enjoy it. Seriously. This will tug at your heartstrings, and you're going to be glad it did. Well, that's the video, and uh, yeah, um, I'm not entirely sure if this is my favorite animated film of this year. I'm still debating about it, but because there's other, you know, some other great ones. But uh, yeah, regardless of my opinion, I feel like this film is gonna go down in history, or at least be talked about years from now, because it's a damn good film. And not only that, it's a fantastic adaption of the original source material, The Little Prince, the original novel. Um, so yeah. I freaking loved it, and I highly recommend that you all watch it. Um, I think that's it. Thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. <sighs> and I'll see you guys later.